everyone, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls, and this is our daily card reading for March 28th, 2019. Let's see what we have going on for today. Exploring new horizons. This is really us getting stretched beyond our comfort zone, okay? But it's going to be good. It's going to be very good. It's the kind of thing that you want to have happen, <laughs> right? I and mean, this is like where somebody's like, oh, I want to try out for a play. Oh, I just want to get a little part of the play. And then you get the lead and you're happy you got the lead, but it, ugh, then you got to get out there and perform, right? It's that, it has that kind of feeling about it. All right. So here we go. The card is Passion, Archangel Haniel. Now Haniel uh, resonates with the phases of the moon. I believe we would have had a full moon. When was that? The 20th, maybe? I don't remember. Um... But yeah, so Haniel's energy is still around. Okay, sorry about that, guys. My battery conked out right as I was <laughs> in the middle of this card reading for today. But basically, I, I think it's interesting because there's like a spotlight. And I, I felt the example of uh, like someone getting on a stage and being seen. So the card is Passion, Archangel Haniel. Trust and follow your renewed passion in your love life and your career. So there's this feeling here of, okay, I'm clear on what I want. I'm going to carry forward with this, but it also comes like your passion comes with being in the spotlight. Either you are completely seen by one other person and maybe you've been single for a while, <laughs> right? Um, or maybe you're reconnecting with someone you've been with for a bit, but now it's like maybe it almost feels like overcompensating. Maybe you went from feeling invisible to now everyone sees me. Or for some of, of you, if you have a book and it finally takes off and all you've wanted was for it to take off and now it's happening and it comes with a bit of responsibility. Following your passion does come with a bit of responsibility because it's now <laughs> kind of like, um, okay, you, you wanted to make this project happen. Here you go. Now it, it, it's time to perform. It's time to make things happen. But mostly this could be falling in love with life all over again. But do you see how determined she is? And she's got her staff with a, a candle on it. She knows which direction to go and she is facing the future. And so there is no looking back. There is no uh, letting people still make you feel guilty for wanting to be successful. And that's really what I feel around this. There's a lot of success, but it doesn't come without first looking at where you have held yourself up in the past, where you have done some bit of self-sabotage, okay? And you want to look at that, that way that you don't, you don't do that all over again, <laughs> okay? So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.